Hey everybody, this is the Urban Coalition of Freelance Writers where we shine the light <clears throat> on issues impacting the urban community. <clears throat> you can check us out um, at www.myspace.com slash UCOFW. Um, hit us up, rate, subscribe, all that good stuff. I'm not going to get into that right now because I'm about to come for uh, Miss Fantasia. See, y'all y'all, y'all going to make me do this now. Because I'm going to have to let this girl have it. Now, we're going to get into this more on my blog talk radio show this Saturday. Y'all don't y'all don't need to miss this because we're going to talk about her. We're going to talk about Alicia Keys' skank behind. Because, to me, there's a problem when, when you are considered an American Idol. And first of all, I don't even like that title. Because... I, I don't like the fact that we're idolizing these people or idolizing these <clears throat> so-called celebrities and they do stuff like this. And I'm not saying they're supposed to be like God or anything, but that's neither here or there. But what I'm saying is Fantasia knows she was wrong. Now, knowing that you have came <clears throat> through a lot of stuff yourself in the past, you know, why would you put yourself back in this situation or in a crazy, crazy situation where you're about to risk everything that you own? And see, this is what I'm saying. When you are in a spotlight, you have to really watch what you're doing. And one thing about it is I can't feel sorry for someone that puts themselves in this situation. And I'm not judging them, but I can't feel sorry for you at the same time because especially if you've been through all this stuff and you 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 didn't went around saying that you've you know came through all this stuff and you have overcame all these obstacles and stuff and you put yourself back in this situation. You know, and then I guess now they're seeing how Fantasia, you know, um took some pain medication, some pain pills and tried to overdose on that because now you want everybody to feel sorry for you. No no boo. Now let me tell you something. I'm a Fantasia fan no doubt. But one thing I'm not going to do is justify what she's, she's done. Now, she knows she was wrong going after this man. Now, we're going to talk about another theory that I have um, this Saturday on my blog talk radio show. Y'all need to make sure y'all check that out. I'm going to have the link in this video, or you can check it out on the side of the video. But definitely, y'all need to come over there and support. Um... You can check us out on blogtalkradio.com slash U-C-O-F-W. Um, come in, you know, register. You might you need to register ahead of time. It's free. Um, so you can chat or you can call in um, the call-in number, which I'll have that information in the um, description field as well. But this is going to be one of many topics that we're going to talk about. We're going to talk about... Um, the lack of integrity in the hip hop industry, the, or not the hip hop, yeah, the hip hop industry, or just the entertainment hi industry in general. So until then, make sure you comment, rate, and all that stuff. Um, and we will talk to you soon. I hope to see you guys. Hope to um, hear you guys on our blog talk radio this Saturday. Talk to you soon. Once again, this is Seneca Harris signing out.